So now in this video, we're just going to take a quick look at using these uh, male header pins with a breadboard. So usually I use them to clip the uh, alligator clips from the power supply to the breadboard. They make a, a fairly good connection like that, temporary connection. And uh, it's pretty easy to uh, break them off. Got this uh, little pliers right there. And you just twist it uh, both ways. It comes right off uh, pretty easily right there. And then we uh, can only plug these uh, shorter ones are too short. The longer ones will go into uh, female connectors such as the uh, breadboard. And of course that's a row sideways right there. And uh, there we go. So both these pins are in the same hole there. And now we can really easily, I'll, uh, I'll back up. As you can see those pins uh, plenty fine. Just uh, connect the power supply directly to it right there. The three really holds up good and uh, even two holds up pretty good right there. We have a uh, pretty solid connection, pretty easy way to use the alligator clips. If you clip them directly to the component, the component kind of wiggles and whatnot, uh, might not make as good of a connection. And uh, so that's not as good as of an idea. Better to just plug it to headers like that. The shorter header would be for like circuit boards and stuff, uh, thinner boards where you solder the other side on there. And then you have the header pin, the longer pin, I should say, the male there, out so that you can connect female connectors too. Again, the shorter ones are too short. They don't make a connection. It didn't, uh, didn't click at all in there and it falls right out. So in any case, that's it. Very simple video. Hope you enjoyed. Make sure you check out one of the other videos I'm posting on the screen and check out the links down below. They all help out a lot. I'll see you in the next video.